Deepika. Welcome to my channel. Today I have created this Rakhi special look for beginners. This is quick and easy as I haven't used any eyeshadow palette and instead I have used a colored eye pencil. If you wish to learn how I created this eye look, do watch the video till the end. Please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to get notified whenever I upload a new video. Starting with Neutrogena Hydro Boost Water Gel, it is in gel form, perfect for combination as well as oily skin tone people. After this, I will groom my eyebrows and today I will use eyebrow pencil from Maybelline in shade brown. First, I will outline the eyebrow and then I will fill the gaps using small small strokes. I want my eyebrows to look natural so I won't make it too dark. I will show you a detailed video of how I do my eyebrow in another video. This look is for beginners so I will try to use less tools to show you this makeup look. At last I will comb both the eyebrow with a spoolie and it is a PAC brush. Moisturizing my lips with a lip balm. As an eye base I am using LA Girl Pro Conceal shade Pure Beige on my eye. I'm spreading the product with my finger as you can see. To make it more even, I'm using a small beauty blender. To fix the concealer so that it doesn't crease, I'm using some loose powder and applying it with the same small beauty blender and it's done today's eye look i'll be creating with a cold pencil this is from pac and it has a shader at the back so applying a thick layer on the area where i apply eyeliner shade of this cold pencil is navy blue as this cold pencil has a shader so I won't be using any eye brushes. Now smoking out the product with the shader. I will be shading on all the areas of my eyelid and I won't cross the crease line. I am applying another layer over it and again the same process shading it out with the shader you can leave it like this if you want but I want to add some glitter on my eye This is loose glitter from Makeup Forever. You can use any glitter of your choice. Showing the same process on my left eye. So I will show it in a quick manner.
finally adding glitters I am pressing the glitter so that it gets fixed on my eyes cleaning the glitters from my face starting my base makeup and to get a smooth base I'm using a primer from PAC pumping out the product directly on my face and now applying it with my hands you cannot skip primer if you want a long lasting makeup after this step I will not use any corrector but if you have dark circles then you can use an orange corrector today I will use a CC cream complexion care cream instead of foundation and this is from Lakme 925 shade is bronze now blending it with a damp beauty blender this CC cream is available in four shades so you can have it according to your skin tone Applying the same concealer which I used for my eye base, Ally Girl Pro Conceal on my under eye areas, on my nose. And slightly on my chin. Blending it with a damp beauty blender in dabbing motion Applying translucent loose powder from color bar on all over my face with a powder brush and this brush is from PAC again. You can also use a compact for doing this step if you don't have any loose powder. Again I am applying some loose powder on the areas where I want to highlight. I haven't applied any contour yet but still my face looks a bit sculpted because of this step. If you do this step then you can avoid contouring but I have a round face so I will do contouring on my usual areas. I am using a powder contour from PSC. And with a brush from the same brand, I'm applying the powder on my cheeks. Contouring to hide my double chin. Coming back to my eyes and I'm applying the same cold pencil on my lower lash line. Smudging it off with the shader. After this, I have applied Kajal on my waterline and the Kajal is from Color Bar and then smudging both the shades with the shader. Though there is no fallout but I will dust some loose powder on my under eye area. I forgot to do my nose contouring so I will be doing it now. And with a small contour brush, I am contouring my nose. Next, I am using a blusher from PAC and this is a coral shade. 
I am applying very lightly with the same powder brush. Finally highlighting in a corner of my both eyes and brow bone. This highlighter is from Wet n Wild and the shade is Blossom Glow. For today's look I will skip highlighting my cheekbone because I don't want too much shine on my face. But I will highlight my nose and slightly my lips. Curling my lashes before applying mascara and for mascara I have taken Maybelline Colossal Mascara applying on both my upper and lower lash line. I am applying a liquid lipstick from NYX in shade Exotic. It's a nude shade. And finally, to fix and set, I'm applying Makeup Revolution Setting Spray. You can see my sparkling eyes. Thank you everyone for watching this video. I hope you all enjoyed it and if you do so, please give a big thumbs up and share your feedback through comments. I left my hair open because I want a simple look. If you wish, you can follow me on Instagram. I'll be sharing many more makeup tutorials, product reviews as well as eye look on my upcoming videos. So do keep watching my videos. See you on my next video. Bye bye friends.